terms of the minutes for this game, this was how I would lay it out, 240 minutes across the course of the game. Steph, 32 minutes. I actually had that um, penciled down already <laughs> before Stephen even said that. I thought 32 minutes was the right amount for Steph. So I'm glad Steve and I are on the same page when it comes to that. Uh, I'm going to be interested to see if Wiggins is on a minute restriction. I've got him at 22 here just because I, I think he might be. Two preseason games played around the 20, 20, 20 to 22 minute mark. Maybe that should remain the case for the first few games. I don't know. We'll wait and see what Steve has to, to say on that. It'll be interesting. I think that's something he will announce beforehand, so we might hear about it in the next 24 hours or so. I've got Wiggins at 22, Kaminga at 28, Draymond at 30. I don't think Draymond should be playing any more than 30. I think, like Steph, the Warriors should be trying to lessen his burden as much as possible. And then I've got TJD at 28, which is maybe slightly higher, but I'll get back to it in a second. Then off the bench, these are my five off the bench. Pods playing 22 minutes, Melton playing 22 minutes, Buddy Heald playing 18 minutes, Moses Moody playing 20 minutes, and Kyle Anderson playing 18 minutes. That would be my five off the bench. So what that means is 28 minutes of Trace Jackson Davis. Now, that means no Kavon, I've got no Kavon Looney. Now, I can see Steve going to 11 and Loon being the 11th, right? And therefore, maybe Trace plays 20 and Loon plays eight to 10 minutes or something like that, and maybe a couple of minutes less for slow-mo because in this rotation, I've got 28 minutes of TJD at center, 15 minutes of Draymond at center, and I've just thrown in five minutes of Kyle Anderson at center. Now, can you get away with that against the Trailblazers? I spoke about it with Reese on the season, on, on the preview, sorry, uh, about the, the Trailblazers' size with, of course, DeAndre Ayton, Donovan Klingon, Rob Williams. I think Reese said he's going to be questionable for this matchup. So, can you get away with it? Can Kyle Anderson play five minutes as a small ball center? We didn't really see it over the preseason. I just, it's, if the Warriors want to play their best players, I, which I think is somewhat important. Now, yes, it's got to be in the right lineups and combinations. I get that. But if the Warriors want to play their best players, I just think this is the the 10 best players. And then Loon's the 11th. GP2 is out of the mix as well, of course, in this rotation that I've, I spoke about here. So can you get away with Kyle Anderson? If you can't, maybe it's, you know, Kyle Anderson only plays 13 to 15 minutes. Looney plays, you know, an, an extra five minutes at centre. And maybe he takes some of TJD's and, you know, TJD plays 20 and Loon plays 10 to 15. I, I don't know. There's so many different ways that Steve could go. But this is just what I'm kind of outlining in my head and what I've written down here. Again, Steph 32, Wiggins 22, Kaminga 28, Draymond 30, TJD 28, which is probably, again, I'll reiterate, that's probably a bit of a high point, but if you're not going to play Loon, then TJD probably needs to play a fair bit. And again, trying to get the upside out of the young guy and trying to get the development there and how that could change the Warriors and influence the Warriors over the course of the season, I think is important. Pods 22, Melton 22, Heal 18, Moody 20, Slow Mo 18. Let me know what you think of my minutes dispersion there in the Warrior rotation for the season opener against the Trailblazers on Wednesday. Let me know what minutes you'd be given different guys, whether or not you think Loon, GP2 should be in the mix, whether you're disappointed that Lindy Waters the third won't be in the mix, as, as Steve has confirmed. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, then you can check out the full episode of the podcast here. Otherwise, make sure to like and subscribe for more Warriors content throughout the season.